Did you watch the uh, McGregor versus Diaz? Because I believe Skip Bayless of ESPN said that uh, McGregor can hang with you after watching his boxing skills, apparently. <laughs> this is coming from Skip Bayless of ESPN. <laughs> what are your thoughts on that? Uh, everybody's a top down. <laughs> but what about the fact that I read somewhere that combined Diaz and McGregor made five million dollars? I mean, compared to boxing, what what could possibly be done to change that that situation in the UFC to get you know fighters the the money that they're entitled to? Eventually, I'm going to move over, but I'm going to stay still and be involved with boxing. But we're going to be I'm going to be in both MMA and in boxing, and we want to make sure once again the talent wins. It's all about the talent winning. How integral is Al Heyman in your development? Now you're, you, you went from, you said, only knowing boxing in your first professional career, and now you have an insurmountable amount of uh, fighters now. You're going to Rio to re recruit. Well, you have to, you, um, well, you have to realize this. Certain relationships are meant to be. I never heard Al say anything negative about fighters. Al don't speak negative about any fighters. He don't speak negative about any trainers. He try to, he try to make sure I stay focused, I stay on the right path, and he want all his fighters to stay on the right path and stay focused.